Today, I want to talk to you about castor oil packs. Castor oil, this is the one I tend to use. Hexane free, really important. And we're talking about external castor oil packs. And I'm coming to you live from my bedroom because I'm actually going to show you how to do a castor oil pack. But first, let me tell you why. So if you have any um, menstrual difficulties, any heavy bleeding, clotty periods, crampy periods, or if you have any cysts or fibroids that you know of, doing a castor oil pack from cycle day one of your period, so the first day of bleeding, all the way up until ovulation can be really useful in helping improve circulation and blood flow to the uterus, to the ovaries. Castor oil has been used for thousands of years by all sorts of cultures with the premise that it helps improve lymphatic circulation, it helps bring warmth and healthy blood flow to the uteries, uterus and the ovaries. As well, it helps break up masses. So I've had patients with tumors, you know, that, that has nothing to do with, with fertility or getting pregnant, or um, enlarged livers, um, fatty liver disease, anything like that to do the castor oil packs because it really helps improve the circulation of any organ that you put it over, and it has the added benefit of breaking up these masses. But when it comes to fertility and uterine health and ovarian health, it's really important for women that see signs of you know clots in their period or know for sure that they have cysts or fibroids or really just want to do something to improve uterine and ovarian health during the follicular phase. It really can't hurt and it's quite soothing, feels really nice. Um, I recommend that you, we'll show you how to put it on. I'm going to demonstrate myself so you can see hands-on how it goes down when you're doing it by yourself. And I usually recommend leaving it on 30 or so minutes. And that's a good time to either meditate or read an article, something like that. There is no television in my bedroom, and I don't believe there should be televisions in any bedroom. Bedrooms are for sleep and sex and for some meditation or castor oil packs if that comes uh, necessary for you. So I'm going to adjust my camera, and I'm going to lie down and show you how it's done. So a little bit about me. Um, most of you know that I... Got pregnant naturally and easily at the age of 40, but I wound up having a C-section. Bummer. So I'm going to do this over my C-section scar. And in preparation for trying for baby number two, which we will probably start trying in about six months, I'm going to be doing regular castor oil packs during my follicular phase into ovulation to help break up if there's any adhesions or scar tissue from the C-section. And again, like I said, it's great for uterine and ovarian health. So real quick, what you need, castor oil. You need a cloth of some sort. Some recommend a flannel. I'm just using an organic cotton washcloth and I'll show you. And then a hot water bottle, preferably over a heating pad, please. Heating pads are electricity, not the best uh, currency to have over your uterus. So I use this hot water bottle. It's filled with hot water. These things you can buy on Amazon for $10. They're amazing. And then I also have a towel just in case for any spills. And I am laying on a towel because this can stain, okay? So I'm going to lay back. I'm going to put everything over here. Can you guys see? Okay. I'm going to scooch down. You can kind of see my scars from my C-section, but not really. I, I did a lot of acupuncture on it, and it's really healed nicely. Um, so I'm going to squeeze out the castor oil. Oops. First, let me take off the foil. Okay. So castor oil is pretty thick. It's not really that, you know, um, it's not going to slip around too much. So I apply a nice thick layer. So some say you can soak the cloth in the castor oil and then reuse the cloth up to 30 times. I just find this is easier and a little less messy. Then I put the cloth, just a thin layer over, and then heating pad. Ooh, feels so good, or hot water bottle, sorry. So that's it. So the goal is you want to do it 
under your belly button, between the pubic bone and the belly button. Cover that whole area with castor oil, then the cloth, then the hot water bottle, and you're just gonna lie here. It's a great time to do your uterine mantra. Dear uterus, you are the palace of my child, and I believe in you. You are brimming with fertility, and I fully believe in your ability to get and stay pregnant. If you don't know my uterine mantra, it's in my book, Yes, You Can Get Pregnant. I highly recommend reading that for other ways to naturally improve your fertility. I practiced everything I write about in that book and, like I said, got naturally pregnant at the age of 40 and plan to do the same at the age of 42 and a half. So that's your castor oil pack. Again, great for improving circulation and blood flow to the uterus and the ovaries, warming the reproductive system, breaking up any adhesions, clots, cysts, stagnation. And this is for topical use only, so remember that, okay? Until next time. <laughs>